Hi beauties, welcome back to my channel. Today I am making a video about swimwear. Honestly, I've had the privilege to go through so many different seasons with my body. If it was pre-babies, while having babies, after babies, it really taught me so many lessons and so many little tips about what kind of swimwear works best for me and all these different phases in my life. I'm here to show you and share with you tips that I've learned that will help you find a bikini that is best for your body. So my first bikini is this gingham bikini. This one I actually purchased in Israel, but this specific fit just works so well for me. I have now a smaller bust than I used to before kids. <laughs> the joys of having children and when I look for bikinis I am looking for something that will complement my bust area so this has a tie on the top which helps to really dictate how tight you want it to go this can either make your bust look kind of bigger optical illusion or something that will be more looser and more comfortable depends on what you prefer also the fit of the bottoms are higher waisted although not like high high waisted it's kind of like mid high waist but then also the cut of the leg area is higher which helps to give that elongated leg illusion the second bikini is actually a mix and match the bendo top actually belongs to a whole different bikini and the bottoms belongs to another bikini so what I like to do is mix and match just to also be able to get more out of my bikinis and that's why I feel like I also go for a lot of solid colors but for this specific bikini I loved the combination of that pink with the forest green the next bikini is one of my favorites I've had it for years and I got it after I had Benjamin my second baby and for me this was such a comfortable bikini to be in first of all the fabric of this bikini it dries up so fast and I'm gonna try to link it in the description box or something similar but also the fit is very comfortable there's a lot of support on the bust area there's a lot of support on the bottom so it covers this has been kind of my go-to bikini whenever I feel like I need something that will make me feel a little sexy when I don't necessarily feel what I'm sexy because it's super high-waisted it actually does such a great job with not only covering the tummy but also kind of accentuating the waist which is always a great way to give that beautiful hourglass Mm. even if you don't have curves like I don't really have curves curves so this kind of brings another aspect of curves yes the next bikini is actually more about the top. That's the reason why I wanted to show you. This is more of like a sporty kind of fit for a bikini. This is something that I wear when, let's say, I go to the pool with the kids or swim with the kids or anything that involves just like moving a lot and you don't want your bikini top, if it's small, you don't want it like to move anywhere. So this one has just a really comfortable fit. It's kind of like a sports bra that just to make sure that you are comfortable and you don't have to worry about about it while out there enjoying your time with your family. Another tip for cover-up that I really wanted to share with you, I have this thing with kimonos, so I find them just randomly around and if I like the colors, I'll get it. And I use a lot of them for cover-ups for the beach, but also repurpose them and actually like would wear them as either a dress or like in the evening on top of shorts and like a top. So kimonos are a great way to find kind of like a more creative, beautiful patterns to mix with your solid bikini. The next bikini, is one with a pattern I personally love stars there's something magical about it so when I saw this bikini I knew I wanted to have it I did go for more neutral colors rather than necessarily having like orange and pink stars I went for kind of navy dark and white stars and it still hits the spot when it comes to pattern and like a fun bikini but also I know that I'll be able to wear it for a while because I hate spending money on something that I literally like for one month and then stop wearing it this is a fit that that I found that's been giving me a lot of like encouragement I've been working so so hard on making my body stronger not necessarily bouncing back to my pre-baby weight or look but more of like creating a new better stronger version of myself so this bikini just encourages me to keep working harder and I get to show myself off to myself 
of like you know and showcase all the hard work that I've been doing in the past year and a half I have to say that I feel more confident today than I've ever felt even before I had children or had any of this like grown-up worries in my life I feel stronger and just more put together and I feel I feel like a woman you guys know how obsessed I am with button-down white shirts, men's white shirts, or in general just like oversized. This is another great way to utilize one. I actually grabbed this one from Gary's Closet. This is a linen button-down and I use it so often as my beach cover-up. It's linen so the fabric is breathable. It has this like kind of nonchalant vacationing in Europe type of look and also it is a solid color. It's white. It looks good with any bikini and I don't have to constantly go and find a different cover-up her bikini to match it. The next swimwear is a one piece. It's a classic. It's a great go-to for anyone if you want to just be a little more covered up, if you want to focus on certain areas and not others. There's so many beautiful, beautiful patterns and colors and shapes to it. This one specifically is kind of more plunge. So if you have nice, you know, bust area, this is a great one to showcase them. Yes, English. Hmm. Also for me, I used to go and I still go for a little more coverage on the butt. So this one has a great kind of coverage there. And in general, I just feel like they're flattering for everyone. And I think that right now there's a lot of really affordable, great options out there that you can get if you are into the one piece and just want to own one. Because, you know, for those days where you just need a one piece. I thought this was going somewhere, but it didn't. This one is kind of my splurging bikini. This is from Zimmerman, and I just love the color. There's something so romantic, so girly about it. And I don't own a lot of those like really extra bathing suits in my closet, but this one is more towards like grown-up vacations, when I go with my husband somewhere nice. If you have smaller bust like myself, square necklines are actually a great, beautiful way to kind of complement the shape and what you got. I often wear a lot of crop tops, on vacations in the evening so because it's so pretty and you can kind of dress it up you can put a pair of linen pants on the bottom and just rock it as a top and then we have the classic black bikini which I feel like every woman should own in her closet you need to find your perfect fit get it in black and it's honestly so timeless just like the little black dress. This one specifically is a fit that I found that I really love. So when I find something that I really love, I'll get it in a few different colors. So this one I got in forest green, in like deserty orange, and in a bluish, like ocean blue. For me, they're kind of like my go-to solid, never will go out of style type of bikinis to own. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. To check out seven fashion rules every woman should learn once and for all, click here.